today we are going to be reviewing this brand new Elite Royal Rumble Cody Rhodes! What? Fresh from the Ringside Collectibles Warehouse, this new Cody Rhodes Royal Rumble Elite, and I know one guy right here who is incredibly I, thrilled for this. I'm, I'm really excited because this is from this year's Royal Rumble and it's getting closer to WrestleMania 40 so that we can have the brand new WrestleMania yeah. 40 Cody Rhodes that they hadn't even announced that you're just making it up in your head, but I know it sounds like wishful thinking. Let's take a look at the back of the box. There's the American Nightmare Cody Rhodes. Now, notice, I don't know, I was reading this read-up right here, and this thing talks about WrestleMania 39. Not sure why, because it's as it. Ryder just said, it's from the 2024 Royal Rumble. But who else comes in this Royal Rumble Elite Series? Of course, another Hulk Hogan, yeah. the Hurricane, D Diesel and the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. Then also a piece of the Great Khali Bobo figure that comes with this. That figure is going to be ginormous. What piece is it, Ryder? The torso. Tor the torso. Dude, go ahead and hop on in this thing. This thing is massive. You are not lying. That great Collie build a figure piece is humongous. <laughs> See if you can close your fist around it. I don't think you can. No, not at all. I cannot. Holy cow. Let's get into the Royal Rumble Elite. Cody Rhodes, what else does he come with? He comes with three sets of interchangeable hands and the Great Khali torso. Of course. Yeah. And the American Nightmare belt. And something is a little bit different about this American Nightmare belt. What is it, Ryder? Is that it has like this, like this, it's not like the regular. Yeah, like and this. just for context, we'll... Put, it, put one of the old Mattel ones on the screen. So right here, you can see that the Mattel Cody Rhodes American Nightmare belts are finally getting a little upgrade. Yeah, because like, it doesn't have like the holes in them. Well, it does. It's just shaped a little bit yeah. differently. Here, you had mentioned something about the quality. So here is the old Mattel, here's the new Mattel. What did you say about this thing? Is that it's like smaller and it's more flimsy. I noticed too that the detail, if you look right here on the Mattel one, you can see like the stitching right there at the top and the bottom. And this one right here does not, or excuse me, this one right here does not have that. And moving on to the head scan. We have seen this head scan before and it's just like a straight face. Yeah, no interchangeable head or anything. Oh, there it is right at the tattoo. I, that, that makes me freak out because like, look, it's not even... It's like it never lines up. Again, though, I, I have hey, to... Hey, at least it wasn't as bad as the basic one. Oh, that one was terrible. Like, it was like this. Again, though, imagine how hard it is to get that tattoo right on two separate pieces of the figure. And make oh, it match yeah. up. It's got to be difficult. Yeah, definitely. And moving down to the torso, as you can see, it has like a little bit of his chest hair. And it also has his tattoo. His dream tattoo. It looks like he got a... Maybe he's always had that six back there, but that looks definitely more defined than it has been being as of late. Moving on down to the ring tights here. What colors are these ring tights and what can you tell us about them? They are red, white, blue, black, and gold. And it has like this little bird logo on his, like on the back and stars. And it looks like, I'm not sure what that logo is. For you watching at home, if you know what that logo is. It kind of looks like his mask. Maybe it is. I don't know. Maybe some prelude to that. Let us know. I've always been curious. I mean, do, do you know what that logo is, right? Oh, no. Moving on down to the boots. What can you tell us about those? It is white with the American Nightmare logo. And it looks like it has fangs on that side. Fangs? Yes. This is like a special Halloween edition. <laughs> I guess. Cody Rhodes. Yeah, I mean, not on that side. You see the most obscure things dude i swear <laughs> it looks like it if you are a cody rhodes fan this is a must have in your collection because like it signifies his road to wrestlemania for it's the start right there the royal rumble 2024 and what an epic run the american nightmare has had now i need to confess something to you watching at home when this royal rumble elite cody rhodes went up for pre-order this guy right here 
went ahead and pre-ordered one without me knowing. A month or so later, I get an email from Ringside Collectibles letting me know that this Cody Rhodes right here, that they are now taking pre-orders. And I said, what the heck? <laughs> Ran over to Ringside Collectibles. I used code word Ryder Wood to save myself 10% check out and you know what I did bought one of these so we now have an extra because of lack of communication <laughs> so comment down below and let us know what we should do with this Cody Rhodes elite should we keep it MOC because you know that's something this guy doesn't do a lot of <laughs> should we open it and put it in Ryder's other Cody collection or should we do a giveaway or should Ryder hold on to it because this Friday we're going to Smackdown and the American Nightmare Cody Rhodes is supposed to be there should Ryder hold on to this and try and get it signed if you're a fan of live WWE vlogs check out this playlist right here thank you for spending a little bit of your time with us we love you all that's it for me Ryder Bye!